I left my truck running while I was washing my face and brushing my teeth and getting ready this morning. So we're about to do a little pre-trip. I'll take y'all through the little basic stuff, but I'm gonna go ahead and get the rest of it done myself. Let's get in here. It's very, very, very cold this morning. Sheesh. All right. Put it back there. All right. So you wanna cut your headlights on? My bad. You cut your flashers on. Cause you wanna make sure you check your lights and stuff. Check your gauges, check your lights. Uh, let me check the outside first, stuff first. I'm gonna go around here. Step back a little bit. Check underneath, make sure there's no leaks. There's no leaking. You wanna check your headlights. You wanna check your flasher. Your clearance lights, shoe and shield. You just wanna walk around. Check all your tires. All your lights from the trailer, clearance lights, flashers. You wanna come back here, check these lights also. And you wanna make sure no one pulls your king pin. No matter where you at, cause people will do it. And I don't trust it, so I always check it and I always tug at it. Come back here. Check those tires too tires i'm just gonna run you guys through this i'm pretty sure you probably already know if not i'll get you right i'm gonna check these lights too check all your lights check all your lights your tires mud flaps check that light it is super cold out here so i'm not gonna stare here too long you also want to get in the habit of um Maybe checking your fluids every now and then. Make sure you're good, you know. Better safe than sorry, so. I haven't checked my fluids in a while, so I'm gonna go ahead and check my fluids and make sure, um, well, I checked them a couple days ago. But I just wanna make sure everything is good because I like to do a thorough pre-trip before I leave the service just in case I need anything. You just never know what to go on. So um, I'm gonna check my fluids, but I won't get back with you guys until I uh, get to my shipper, till I get to the shipper. Um, so. Until then, peace. Just got to the receiver. I mean the shipper, my bad. Let me see if I can pitch all up somewhere, but I, don't, I doubt if I can. Let me try. If I can put y'all up somewhere. You can watch me bag in. Hold on one second. kind of dock we took all the pieces down when you get to bump the dock it's like just cement there turn my trailer up that's why i got out and look you always want to make sure you get out and look go get out and look
It's gonna be nippy in here. Well, get to the back. But yeah, so I'm here. It's about to load me up. I was only like 49 minutes away. Slept in um Roanoke, Virginia. I'm taking this load right here to North Carolina. Now I'll take my home time. I'm back out and I gotta take another load. Gotta pick up a load in green, uh I pick up a loading in North Carolina. I'm taking that to Richmond, Virginia, Sunday. I'm gonna see if they'll let me stay out. I'm gonna stay home till Monday because I can I can easily get to that place in like two hours where I gotta deliver to Monday, have it by Monday. But they probably want to go out Sunday, so and you get more loads like that, you know. Well, I wouldn't say get more loads, but you know, if I go ahead and deliver that, if it gotta be delivered Monday, and I go ahead and deliver it Sunday, that means I'll have an opportunity for more loads. But if I deliver that Monday, you know, I might get cut short on the load. So I don't know what I would do yet. So we'll just see. But um, I'm about to chill out. Probably do another video. But I'll see you guys when I get, when I, either when I finish, when they finish loading me, or when I get to um, the constantly. So, peace. So, guys. Oh, I just got loaded up I to close my doors here in North Carolina and then I gotta wait on somebody to pick up a load from them and go to my home terminal and I'm going home for the weekend so uh, see you guys soon bye bye so I just got to North Carolina dropped my load I'm about to unhook from it um, I gotta wait on another driver to bring my load for me to take home time because I'm taking that to like I said I'm taking that to Virginia uh, Monday I have to deliver that Monday probably leave out Sunday and then after that they gave me another load so I'm picking back up in Virginia and I'm heading towards heading to Mobile Alabama ready let's unhook this sucker let's unhook this sucker I would fuel up but I'll probably fuel up uh take you guys with me I'll probably fuel up um when I get ready to leave but I'm probably stuck here for a while because uh, my, the trailer that I'm supposed to be getting is not here right now. So anyways, I guess I'm stuck here for a few hours. Hopefully not too long. Ready, already, already, already. Come around here. I'm gonna try, I'm gonna mess my hat up. I just got this hat nice and fresh. I'm gonna pull that sucker right here. Pull this, pull your hand up. I try to put it up here. I wanna get my darn coat dirty. So I'll be trying to do it a different way. That's why I never get it the first time. Put down your landing gear. So yeah, um, I'm probably stuck here for a little while. Probably upload a video. Uh, maybe just think of some other videos to do. Cause I just want to give you guys a bunch of videos. Check everything. See how it's going. See how it's going. Alrighty. Alrighty. Alright. Everything's good. Go settle down somewhere. So I got it unhooked. When I fill up, I'll get back on with you guys. But until then, peace out. So, I apologize. I was like, give, I was like, give you, give, I was like, giving you guys. Can't talk right. I was like, giving you guys a video of um a day in the life of a truck driver, and I was doing good that morning. But I was getting home, so I was excited. So I didn't give y'all a video of when I uh, 
filled up and whatnot. But we're gonna pick back up. I think I was last in Greensboro. If not, we're gonna pick back up in VA. But I'm thinking I was in Greensboro. So we're gonna pick up from there. Now I'm here. Uh, it's not all in the same day, because I got excited, so I forgot to record and whatnot, but I'm gonna give it to you now. So, as you can see, back into a dock. Um, I'm currently in Williamsboro, Williamsburg, Williamsburg, Kentucky. Um, it's right here, but it's right there by the um, Tennessee line too. Tennessee and Kentucky line. Um, I'm taking this load home. It is Friday. I'll be going tomorrow sometime. Um, so I'm taking this home with me. I was gonna take this to, well, I'm getting unloaded now, my bad. I'm getting unloaded, then I have to go nine minutes down the road and I get loaded up. I'm taking that load home. And I was going to um, Kent, Kinston, North Carolina. Monday, but they changed that, so I'll be going to somewhere in Virginia, which is like two hours away. So, anyways, then time change, time spring springs forward. I think uh, Sunday, so I have to add that in there. So uh, we're gonna see where things go. Um, I'm about to chill out, wait to unload me, and I'll see you guys at my next destination. All right, peace. So I just got to um, hold on one second. I just got to the Dern shipper that I'm at right now. And when I say, hold on, so let me sit y'all down real quick. Sit y'all down real quick, hold up. When I say looks, it's just ridiculous, it's ridiculous. I'm gonna show y'all. All these cars and whatnot, what have you. Matter of fact, let me make sure, I have numbers I need to put in real quick. Right, hold on one second. It's just crazy out here. I mean, cars everywhere. If you know big trucks gotta get through this place, why would you let the people park? Why would you let them park right there? Why would you put a parking lot where the truck gotta come in at? But hey, I ain't complaining. I'm gonna get in there sucking, I'm gonna get out of here. But it just, it's, it's annoying. You must want somebody to tear your car up. Oh boy, it is what it is. But I'm gonna show, show y'all what I'm talking about. I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you. Take a picture of all these numbers because I'm about to write these numbers down. Let's get it. Let me show all this crazy crap. Look at this. Let me get out of this truck. Let me get out of this darn truck. Look at this. Straight up bull crap. I mean ridiculous. Look at look at the cars. And I had to get in this sucker. I had to get up in here. Straight through there. See? I should have stayed where the heck I was. Cuz, what time is it? About 11, it's 11, 19 right now. And they got the nerve to tell me, they got the nerve to tell me that um, this sucker won't be, they won't get this sucker loaded up to 1.30 or two. It's 11. When I say there's always some bull crap, trust and believe there's always some bull crap. But I had to get the other load there. I swear there's always something. Always something. Oh, during two o'clock. Tiny suckers get loaded. I've been ran out of during hours. Jesus Christ. Eleven. You tell me you can't get me loaded up to one thirty two o'clock. You are ridiculous. <laughs> but hey, you gotta have patience. Though. You gotta have patience. You gotta love it. You got to love it. But um, I'm about to back this sucker in and just sit here until they get me loaded. They say, oh yeah, we'll load you up uh, slowly. Okay, okay, buddy. But anyways, I'll see you guys soon. Peace. All right. Came in through here through all those cars. 
pull it up around, kind of curved a little bit. I was spacing right here. But I had to back up a little bit up in here, then I pulled forward. And I just bagged it from my side. And let's see how I did. I'm on the line a little bit, but it's so tight and whatnot. But look at the other side. So, anyways, let's go put these wheel trucks down. I don't know how in the heck. I'm gonna to have to figure out how the heck I'm gonna get out of here. I gotta figure it out. I was gonna wait to show you guys from when I left. I mean, get back on here when I left, but I'm gonna have to figure out how the heck I'm gonna get out of here. Anyways, I'll figure something out, I guess. But. This other wheel truck gun. It's always some bull crap. I hope this is what Doc he wanted me to get at. Cause they don't have no numbers up here. He said five, so I went to the sucker at the end. Can never get. I can never just get the freak home when I need to. This is Jesus. Oh well. Anyways, I'll see you guys when I leave. Peace. What's up, y'all? So. 11 to 1, but it's 1 now, 124. Just got loaded up. About to head to Greensboro. I'm gonna sleep there tonight. Sleep in North Carolina tonight. And um, we're gonna make it happen. So uh, I'm about to get ready to go. I'll see you guys soon. Peace.